Hello, my name is James. I work at the Marshville Goodwill. My role is um, cashier. Um, wonderful position. I've walked, um, coming this August, I've worked here for nine years. DBR's Division of Vocational Rehabilitation. They were trying to get it so I'd be able to work in an atmosphere where it was gonna be set up for me with my MS and everything. And um, they started out with uh, Goodwill here. Uh, I, I began to enjoy working here immediately because the people were so kind. It, it, was, it was a hard process to find. Um, myself, I need my wheelchair. I've got multiple sclerosis. Um, I had to have brain surgery, of which they removed uh, three um, brain tumors. Um, the one is still up near my memory and my speech, so it's ongoing. Um, it hasn't grown or anything. So i um, got to work with um, what I have for my physical abilities to work with it. Um, I love having a good time with uh, my customers as they come through the line. Um, I laugh with them, I cry with them. A lot of what we do is trying to help people build job skills, so he was an example of that where he came to Goodwill and he was looking to see what he could do in the community and, and what was he capable of doing. So in, in his case, he had a physical limitation, so sometimes when people come to Goodwill it's something physical, sometimes it's something mental, sometimes it's something emotional. So in his case, he started around eight years ago. And um, yeah, so right away, and as soon as we met James, he was a perfect example of a really positive, upbeat person. When I think of James, I think of the face of Goodwill. I think a lot of times as a store team leader, you're kind of the one that is the face of the community. I think in his role as a cashier, a lot of times he's really the one that is our face for our community and our upbeat and positive and exemplifying our values. So I think, you know, James treats everyone um, again, one of, the, one of the values is treat everyone the way they want to be treated. I think James is a great example of that. Um, one that comes to my mind right away is we have a pretty uh, heavy Hispanic population in town. So James went out of his way and actually Goodwill paid for some for him to have the ability to take some Spanish classes. Um, so he's done just a great job um, with, with that community and really providing a link between helping with communication skills so they can understand us, we can understand them. And it's really cool when you see when that population comes through the, the register, they walk right to his register every time. They know him well and, and he's learned a lot of their language. So, To get to know each and every one of them is just a pleasure to do because I'll tell you what, other way around, they do the same with you and it's like, you know, um, they're there for you, just like I'm there for them. It's like an experienced person never doesn't get to know unless they're actually in that position. Um, it impacts the community quite a bit. Um, people see me as um, somebody with a disability, but somebody that is not going to give up. Now, me with being having a disability with multiple sclerosis, I see people or individuals that actually have disabilities also and I do cue my team leaders into these are people that could possibly work at this store or they need a good start themselves in order to make their lives more whole. You're not alone. The community is here for you. Goodwill is here for you. I wouldn't be able to do it without them. It's just an experience everybody should have because uh, without it, you know, I wouldn't be who I am today. And I appreciate that. Thank mm -hmm. you.